hey guys welcome back in this video i am going to show you how to implement tab layout with bpuser 2 in android studio using kotlin let's create a new project and select empty views activity and click on next button and give the project name here i am giving the project name tab layout kotlin and select the language kotlin and click on finish first go to the build gradles and enable view binding select build feature view binding is equal true right and sync now click on sync now yes sync finish and now go to the resource folder and layout and activity main layout remove this hello world text view delete and add a now select the containers and select here tab layout drag and drop and select a view pager to drag and drop and constraint this and this is view pager to and this is tab layout now see the split view now add the id view pager 2 set the id for view pager view pager 2 now run the app the design is working perfectly now implement we have a three tab so create three fragments one for each now right click here new and create fragment fragment blank first fragment is main fragment click finish and now create a one more fragment as the same way select fragment blank and give the name second fragment and click finish and create one more fragment third fragment you can give the name as your requirement and click finish now we have created three fragment main fragment second fragment and third fragment one fragment for each tab we have a three tabs
now open in and give the gravity center right for this text view and give a big background color and select second fragment set the gravity center for text view and background color and text second fragment and select the third fragment and give a text and give a background color now create a adapter right click here and create a kotlin class and give the name here page adapter segment manager and comma and select life cycle right and extend fragment state adapter and pass here fragment manager and life cycle now hover the mouse here and select implement member select both get items count and create fragment click okay and written 3 because we have three tab and here written when and pass the position right when position is equal 0 then if tab in first position that's mean we will display main fragment so index of first position first tab is 0 then we will call we created here main fragment then pass the main fragment frag, main fragment right and if position 1 copy this 
if position one then we will pass second fragment second fragment and now else else third fragment will display now go to the main activity activity binding binding is equal dot inlet layout inlater binding dot root and a creator adapter page adapter and now initialize the adapter adapter is equal page adapter support fragment manager and life cycle binding dot view pager 2 dot adapter set the adapter for view pager is equal adapter right now add the type selector listener so binding dot tab layout dot add on tab selected listener and create a object here object select tab layout dot on tab selected listener and implement member and select all and click okay now select the on tab selected and write the code here binding dot view pager 2 
डॉट करंट आइटम इज इक्वल टैप डॉट पोजिशन एंड सराउंड विथ नल चक द एरर अकर हियर एंड होवर द माउस हियर एंड क्लिक ऑन सराउंड विथ नल चक ओके नाउ सिंक्रोनाइज द व्यू पेजर विथ टैब ले आउट बाइंडिंग डॉट व्यू पेजर टू डॉट रजिस्टर ऑन पेज चेंज कॉल बैक्स एंड नाउ क्रिएट ऑब्जेक्ट हेयर ऑब्जेक्ट व्यू पेजर टू डॉट ऑन पेज चेंज कॉल बैक and alt plus enter here and select override method and select here on page selected and click okay बाइंडिंग डॉट टेब ले आउट डॉट सेलेक्टेड टैब बाइंडिंग डॉट टैब ले आउट डॉट गेट टैब एट and pass the position here right now code is almost done now run the app now app is working perfectly the main fragment has displayed now click on second fragment now second fragment displayed and now click on third fragment the third fragment also displayed now swipe the fragment yeah app is working perfectly okay Thank you for watching this video